Fix Safari reading list not syncing on iPhone, iPad, and Mac. Turn on iCloud Safari Sync. To turn on iCloud and Safari Sync on iPhone and iPad, open the Settings app. Tap on your Apple ID name. Select iCloud, scroll down and locate Safari. Next to it, toggle the slider to turn on the sync. To turn on iCloud and Safari Sync on Mac, click on the Apple icon and go to System Preferences, then, click on Apple ID. On the left sidebar, select iCloud. Check the box next to Safari. Reboot your device. With any issue, it's a good idea to restart your device. The restart eliminates any bugs and glitches that could have occurred. If the first method didn't fix the issue, restart your iPhone, iPad, or Mac. If the restart doesn't help, only then proceed to the following step. Re-enable Safari at Cloud Sync. To re-enable Safari at Cloud Sync on iPhone and iPad, open the Settings app. Tap on your Apple ID name. Select iCloud, scroll down and locate Safari. Next to it, toggle the slider to disable the sync. Choose if you want to keep the Safari data or delete it from your device. Wait for a few seconds and turn on the sync again. To re-enable Safari at Cloud Sync on Mac, Click on the Apple icon and go to System Preferences, then click on Apple ID. On the left sidebar, select iCloud, uncheck the box next to Safari, and after a few seconds, go back and turn on the sync again. Sign out from iCloud and sign back in. To sign out and back into iCloud on iPhone and iPad, open the Settings app. Tap on your Apple ID name. Scroll to the bottom and tap on Sign Out, restart your iPhone or iPad. Then, log back in by clicking on Sign into your iPhone in the device settings. To sign out and back into iCloud on Mac, from the menu bar, click on the Apple logo and select System Preferences. Click on the Apple ID button. On the left sidebar, select Overview then click on Sign Out at the bottom. Wait a few seconds and sign back in. Update the operating system. To update iPhone and iPad, go to Device Settings. Tap on General. At the top, tap on Software Update. Wait while your iPhone or iPad searches for updates. If found any, tap on Download and Install to update the device. To update Mac, click on the Apple logo located at the menu bar. Go to System Preferences, then click on Software Update. Wait while the Mac searches for updates. If found any, tap on Upgrade Now to update the device. Hopefully, this video provided the information you were looking for. If you are using a Mac computer, we would like to suggest scanning it with Combo Cleaner. It will check your computer for malicious software infections and advertising supported software. The Disk Cleaner option will scan your computer for app caches, logs, downloaded files, and files still sitting in the trash. It will also show you how much space what files to take up on your Mac. Combo Cleaner will also help you look through all big files on your Mac and delete those you don't need. You can also scan Mac for duplicate files. Sometimes you might not know that you have a few copies of the same file. A privacy scanner that will help you remove cookies, cache, browse history and more. And an app uninstaller that will find all hidden app components and uninstall them for you. You won't need to worry about viruses and clutter on your Mac anymore. Thank you for watching. If you found this video helpful, please consider subscribing to our channel.